Dark Wizzy, yeah. and even though Dark Wizzy is an amazing <coughs> player, you just don't get there if you're an, a bad character. Yeah, that's but true. Not even if you're an okay character. So he is a good character, but you know, comparing... One would like to argue about Young Eevee and Bowser Jr. Yeah. Though. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> that, right. That, that's uh, an often misjudged character. Impeccable talent. Right, right. But uh, <laughs> I will say Bowser Jr. not as bad as people think. And yeah. I will also say that although Mario is pretty good, when you're comparing any character to Smash 4 Mario, it's always going to look a bit rough. So yeah, right. that's true. <laughs> that's very true. All right, so game one, Skipper versus CBG. We saw the inkling earlier, right. and now the Mario matchup, where both characters kind of have uh, a little bit of a keep out tool. Yeah, they do, yeah, they do. Of course, the Ooh. question for Mario, oh wow, yeah, right. That Skipper barely touched him. Mm. That was great. The question, of course, with Mario is, he does have those keep away tools. Uh, they're not amazing, but the question really is, because he also has a lot of ground speed and a lot of juicy combos you want to get going, yeah. how are you going to play the character? Because most Marios, uh, they really just start pushing <laughs> buttons. <laughs> they want to push buttons. They want to push, but they bought a controller and they're like, I want to hit the A button. Whoa! And he is hitting Speaking of hitting the A of button. A buttons. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's got some A buttons up his sleeve, this man. Yeah, it looked pretty dire for him when he lost his stock, dealing only 6% to CB6. But look at, or CBG, excuse me, but look at what we got right now. It's almost <laughs> even, and he just got a grab, so it's probably going to be even. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's even as hell. Even he took the lead. Oh, that was a ledge hang there. I don't know if that was supposed to happen. <laughs> yeah, and if I know one thing about Skipper, uh, then it's that he is definitely one of the Mario players that is not too keen on playing uh, a calm keep-away game. <laughs> yeah, no. Of course, like, Mario's projectile is, of course, a projectile, but it is, um, you can follow up on it and right. get some combos going. It's uh, it's kind of nice to oh that's a nice of controller. <laughs> but like you said, it's kind of nice to just throw the fireball and approach behind it. Rarely are people gonna try to camp super hard with it. It's not dangerous enough. It's not damaging enough. It's not fast enough to properly camp out people with it yeah. anyway. You only do that if you have a lead, and you definitely make sure to use flood as well if you're gonna try to camp people. The skipper's never gonna try to camp people. He just saw him get a beautiful back air, and he tried to get another combo going off of a raw four there, but there we go. just not enough hits them. <laughs> oh, okay, <laughs> all right. Speaking of A buttons, that w I feel that was the forward A move, the aerial move. I, 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 saw, I saw it twice. I saw it twice. But. And that's, that's classic he Skipper, man. He grabs his hand and, like, just kind of yeah, puts it yeah, down that, that, into that's the Yeah, that, that's that old <laughs> Mario Hoops 3 on 3. <laughs> I forgot about that game. That was a game. It's been <laughs> so long. I did, man, I've not played that game in a minute. I have never played that game, but I always remember the title. Yeah, I don't know why, but was <laughs> it? it seems to stick in my brain. Actually, I did not play that game. I feel that game was on 3DS. I, I it played, was, There yeah. was an NBA Jam game on GameCube that had Mario in it. <laughs> and that's the one I played. <laughs> that game was sick. All right, speaking of sick, game two, uh, game one going to, I think, Skipper. Right, right definitely. <laughs> I mean, we saw him get that dunk. Yes. And now we have uh, a fresh start for CBG. Switch to the national colors, got it orange. Got the orange. Feeling the pride. Feeling the pride. Plus, it's all heart over Skipper. Is alive in CBG. Or at least the heart of a squid. Let's find <laughs> out if it is about as fearsome as the heart of a lion. We'll have to see. Why is Skipper trying to dunk him at 30? That won't even work. <laughs> Sometimes you just, you gotta hit the A button. You're playing the for A button character. I, I feel like for Skipper, it's not sometimes. It is most of the time. <laughs> <laughs> it's true though. What, are you, what else are you gonna do with Mario? Oh, he's gonna ladder him. That's what he's gonna oh, do, and it's a geez. stock. Jeez. He got a nice zigzag, double up air to the left platform. That was some really good following right. the there. Refreshing his jumps and lettering him all the way the other. And of course, finishing him with a beautiful super jump punch. And uh, Pokemon Stadium is going to be one of the stages where that ladder potential for Mario is a little bit more dangerous because of the low yeah. ceiling. 100%. Plus, there's a platform you can work with just like on Battlefield. Oh my god, thank the really Lord. He's not respecting this man at all. This oh, guy he is not. He is not. I woke up today and was like, you know what? Whoever I'm playing in pools today, they deserve no none of my time or my mental space. Imagine being CBG. You know Skipper is a good player. You get the first stock taking only 6%. He's like, oh, I'm doing pretty well. You know, feel feeling good. Feeling good. And then he just unleashes the A button, the dunks, everything Mario has to offer on you. And he not only does he do it in <coughs> game one, 
in game two, he lets you get away with a pretty big lead. It and then he just once again just completely turns the table on you. It is said that the heart of a plumber has a very good matchup against the heart of a plumber. <laughs> is that so? <laughs> I feel like any good plumber could beat any line in real life. Well, you know, well, we have all the plumbers or a every thousand every or, or a billion lions. <laughs> <laughs> One plumber could do it, dude. A single plumber could take out a billion lions free. I'll bet a million dollars on it. Only if Skipper is controlling game. that plumber, though. That's what true. A dominant game two here. What a just a great showing. A great showing by Skipper, indeed. We we're not even gonna s get to see the rest of the wheel. Uh, yeah. Usually, uh, he's got Donkey Kong, Falco. Captain Falcon, all on that wheel, right. of, of, and he plays them all very aggressively. But you know, if the Mario's working, we're gonna stick with the Mario. Um, like any plumber would, don't right. fix what's not broken. Right, and CBG's gonna stick with the inkling, using that uh, deep, deep purple ink. Left the lion's heart behind. Yeah, like you said, just a poor match versus plumber. Poor match. That's starting off a little strong, got some stuff going. Finding a way in is difficult against those fireballs sometimes. Sometimes you're just trying to do stuff, and you just keep getting hit by him, and there's no way to get in. Oh, here comes the ladder, though. The laddering is coming Right. Up. Oh, Ooh, air dodged. Got out of there. It could have gone a lot worse for CBG. And once again, at the start of the game, he is doing just fine. He is doing just fine. Oh, ground. Even <laughs> using the four there, grounded. He just wants to hit he it. He really likes that move. I don't think even though they're even, I don't think Skip feels threatened at Skipper, all. Skipper, like, above his bed on the ceiling, he has a four air poster <laughs> that he wakes to up to every day. Either way, it's definitely one of the kids that has one of those mini basketball hoops in his bedroom. <laughs> so he can dunk people So all he day. can dunk people. He's been doing it since he was he a wee lad. He dunks in real life. He dunks in the game. That's all you want. All you want. And he can use <laughs> that mean old head as well. Beautiful turnaround up smash from Skipper, but here comes CBG. Tries to go for an offstage edge guard. I like it, Whoa, but now boy. he has a bit of a problem. He has a bit of a problem. The ladder. Ooh, air dodge. Everybody is missing each other. Nice <laughs> patience from Skipper. Though. Right, you got the low range on the up tilt, but it also jumped, so it jumped over Mario's <laughs> grab. Sometimes you have these really weird interactions in Smash, and sometimes Jeez. you just get hit Jeez. by that spicy, spicy meatball. That was rough. I felt that in real life. I need to go to the hospital. That was hot. Now this this is the kind of bodying I was expecting in pools actually yeah. when we started this commentary block, and we did not get with Ato versus Shing, <laughs> and we are getting it now. But because it's a best of five, CBG still has a chance to show us a little something. something. I believe. It. Like I said before, it's uh, a couple of jumps. If you're gonna go out, it's at least nice if you can go out with a little momentum, if you know what I mean. Yeah. To work up that confidence for losers bracket because oh my god I, oh I it's, the time, uh, it's oh, that's so sad that was uh, that was not the that's so sad right that was not the um, the fiery exit you want 